this is corresponding to each one of the screens that we have out there. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, all the way through eleven. We want it to be an environment where someone can walk in, be there for 15 minutes, and never see the same piece of content twice. So screen seven is still not mapped correctly. Let's keep clicking on buttons. I have not a single clue how I'm going to pull that off, but I got to get it done, so I'm sure we'll figure it out. Since 2017, I've been hired year after year to create the content for Pioneer DJ at the NAMM show. The idea was to implement the overall Pioneer brand into these environments. A wall of gears to a sea of fishes and sharks to a full space scene. There's 11 screens surrounding the booth and we wanted everybody who came into that booth to experience a different environment. The idea behind that is, is just utilizing that space to where when you're looking at that scene, you're, you're really engaged in it. So right here, I'm in Cinema 4D. I'm using an Octane render engine, which is a GPU accelerated render engine. There would absolutely be no way I could have executed any of these hands down if it wasn't for the fact that I had the horsepower that I do. So I have NVIDIA GPUs amongst four different machines, and they all work together to be able to render out these frames. By panning the camera around, you can kind of see how quickly it resolves this entire city scene. With one of the GPUs turned on, it took about four minutes to render out. The second all 14 spin up takes about 19 seconds. The speed gains have been insane and it gives me the freedom to add those details, to add more models, and to add more textures. I'm working a lot more efficiently, and that's attributed to the fact that I've been learning every single day about how Octane works, how GPU acceleration works, to where I can render these massive scenes in much shorter times. Every project, I learn something new. Every project pushes me further. And I think at the end of the day, with the GPUs and the GPU render engines, it's really given me the tools to be able to tackle these jobs I've never been able to dream of, of working on. And that's gonna lead to a lot more cool stuff. <laughs>